Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, my smart students. Chapter 4 Moods, Emotion, and Organizational Behavior. Why were emotions executed from uh, OB study? Because they try to create a free emotion environment, which uh, it's uh, impossible to make emotion-free environment in our work. What's the difference between uh, what's our emotion and moods? Uh, um, uh, any experience we pass in our life influences in our life by experience. And we express this experience through emotion or moods. Emotion, it's intense feeling that are directed at someone or something. And the other way to express our uh, our feeling, it's mood. Feelings that tend to be less intense than emotion and that take of conceptual stimulus. Now we are going to compare between emotion and mood. When we are speaking about emotion, we speak about <clears throat> something happened or caused by a specific event. But mood caused by a general or unclear. So, there are differences, uh, major differences between emotion and mood because emotion caused by a specific event. But, uh, Moods often caused by a junior or unclear. It's an emotion very brief in duration, seconds or minutes, but mood more uh, longer than emotion. It's hour or days, maybe weeks or more. Um, we can express specific emotion, but mood, it's not. Uh, it's not that much care. It's more general. It's more general. So um, we we we, uh, we we can express our emotions through a physical uh, a, a face expression, but in moods there is no fa uh, face expression. Um, and finally, emotion uh, followed followed by action, followed by action, action, action oriented in nature, uh, but mood, it's a, it's a, it's a just cognitive, cognitive in nature. What is the basic emotion there? Um, there are uh, 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 six basic emotion, anger, fear, suddenness, happiness, disgust, surprise, can we mistake two emotions? Yes, we can take the closer uh, any two emotions are to each other or the continuum. The more like people are to confuse them. I can confuse between happiness and surprise. I'm happy and surprised. What is this? I'm happy and surprised. And also, uh, sometimes we can uh, mistake uh, anger and disgust. Um, anger and disgust. But uh, really, do we confuse happiness and disgust? Emotion, emotion, dimensions. Emotion, maybe it's a uh, positive or negative, personal of job requirements. And this is the structure of our mood. It's, uh, it's uh, 16. 16. It's, we classify moods, a positive and negative effect. It's 16 mood. Well, we, we should ask ourselves in this issue why we have just six basic emotion why we have a 16 mood because emotion it's uh, intense it's intense it's it's clear but uh, moods it's not clear 
Okay, we do, we we divided uh, uh, moods into positive effect and negative effect. I mean positive emotion and negative emotion. If we ask it ourselves, uh, what is the function of emotion? What's the function of emotion? Actually, the functions of emotion is that emotion complementing a rational approach. Emotions and rationality. Emotions are critical to rational thought. They help in understanding the world around us. And second function, emotion and ethics. New research suggests that ethical behavior may be, uh, may be based to some degree on emotion and feelings. What is the source of emotion and moods? The source of emotion and moods it's different. different. Uh, the first source is uh, personality. Personality is a basic. Uh, it's a basic component of uh, 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 that affect uh, uh, our mood and emotion. Um, personality. It's a combination of uh, heredity factor and genetic. I mean genetic factor and environment factor that affect our mood and emotion effectively intense i mean people express people experience both positive and negative emotion more deeply <clears throat> when they are sad they are very sad and when they are happy they are very happy the whole day of a week and time of a day there is a common pattern for all of us Uh, uh, more positive interaction will likely occur midday and later in the week. We start our we start our week with a, a low with a low positive mood and end of the week with a with a high positive mood. Or let us say that we start our week Sunday and Monday with a high negative mood ended by a low negative mood. This is the way of time of a day, day of a week. Three, weather. No impact according to research between weather and mood and emotion. There is no significant relationship for stress, increased stress, the bad mood. Five, social activities, physical, informal, and other social uh, uh, and social activities that enhance our emotion and mood. Sleep. When we speak about sleep, we are speaking about <clears throat> a number of hours. And we are also speaking about the quality of sleeping. A poor sleep quality increases negative effect. Seven exercise. One one of the best way to enhance the emotion and the mood is exercise, improve mood, especially depression and stress or for the depressed people age older people experience negative emotion less frequently less frequently than yes gender uh, nine gender women show greater emotional expression okay this is the uh, emotion and the mood force. What's emotional labor? 
Uh, emotional labor is an ambiguous expression of organizationally desired emotions during interpersonal transaction at work. And it causes emotional dissonance when an MBE has to project one emotion while stimulacy feeling another. It's emotional labor. When we speak about fate emotion and the other displayed emotion, we speak about fate emotion, the individual actual emotion. But displayed emotion, it's a learned emotion that the organization requires workers to show and considers appropriate in a given job. Surface acting, hidden. Once true emotion, deep acting, trying to change one's feelings based on a displayed rule. Emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence. It's a, bit, it's a person's ability to, to perceive self and other emotion, to understand the meaning of this emotion and regulate one's emotion. What's emotional regulation? Emotional regulation means how to identify and modify the emotion you feel. Change emotions by thinking about more pleasant things, distracting yourself, engaging in uh, relaxation techniques. Why we are studying why we are studying emotion and moods? Actually, we are studying emotion and moods to apply this concept in a business application. We need to study. We need to study uh, uh, emotion and the mood in order to one select a good people. One selection. We need to select a good people. We need to select a positive people. Two, decision making. Our MBE cannot take a right decision while they are depressed. Three, creativity. There is a significant relationship between a positive mood and creativity. I cannot ask my MBE to create something new while he is depressed or feeling a negative feelings. For motivation, promoting a positive mood may give a more motivated workforce, for sure, yes. And also five, leadership. Emotion help convey message more effectively leaders who focus on in, in, in special goals, also generate greater optimums and in, in to select a leader we, we, we should keep our our MBE in uh, in a good mood in a good mood to um, uh, 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 to enhance our leadership or to select a good people to manage our company six. Uh, negotiation, emotion, emotion for sure influencing a negotiator performance. Sometimes we need to display emotion while we feel another. Seven, customer service. I cannot ask my MBE to provide the customer or our customer high quality service why they are the best so i should keep my brain in a good mood and emotion eight job attitude job attitude emotions at work get carried home but really carry over the next day so i should i should uh, keep my employee in a good emotion in order to 
direct their attitude toward the positive attitude toward their job and nine and ten no dive and work based behavior uh, if I keep my MBV in a good mood and emotion, I cannot expect that my MBV were, were engaged in a dive and work be where work be his behavior while they are happy and in a good mood. How can manager influence mood? Our advice is to manager to influence uh, MBE mood, use, honor, or to lighten uh, the moments. Give us more time of appreciation, appreciate. Stay in a good mood. Before asking your MBE to stay in a good mood. And finally, our golden advice be higher a positive a bust of people. Thank you, my MBVs. Seeing you next lecture in China.